Hey, what's up everyone? It's me, Avatar Kasha. Today we're going to have some fun with Ogie Dogie. It did well recently in the Louisville Regionals. I know, I know. What about Leal? But we'll get to a deck that I really liked in Leal later. But first, we're dealing with Ogie Dogie. It was featured on stream. I think it was against Cough. But anyways, the reason why Ogie Dogie is important is because of its Adrena Power ability. It's kind of like Monkey Dory, it needs a dark energy in order to activate its ability. But the main difference is, is that Ogie Dogie gets 100 HP along with its Good Punch attack doing 100 plus damage. Meaning Good Punch does 170. And it, this is coming from a single prizer here, so that's very valuable. But on the surface, it looks hard to set up, which is very understandable, but it's pretty simple to do when you think about it. First things first, uh, we have Tatsugiri here. Uh, Tatsugiri can attract customers, so you could get like an Arvin to get like an Earthen Vessel, EXP share, but I'm getting a little ahead of myself here. But yeah, attract customers is very important to gain supp the supporters that you need. We also have Radiant Greninja to help accelerate energy to discard pile and also the ability to have some draw power. So use Radiant Greninja when you can. Then we got uh, Iron Bundle here as like an extra source of gust with its hyper blower ability. Sure, you don't get to pick the Pokemon, but hey, it may make it easier for Ogie Dogie to knock out a Pokemon. And then items of choice here include the counter catcher it helps like if you're behind on prizes it could happen but if you're behind on prizes you could select any pokemon you want and put it in front and maybe it will be an easier ko then we got earthen vessel to help gain some energy in the hand so we could use concealed cards to accelerate it to the discard energy lotto we have different types of energies in this deck which i'll get to later but energy lotto helps get potentially get an energy card in your hand. It is very useful, especially in this deck. Now, Energy Sticker, it's normally a card that's not used, but Energy Sticker is a card, it's based on luck. If you get heads, you could attach a basic energy from your discard pile to one of your bench Pokemon, so that's a way to accelerate Ogie Dogie. Only if you get heads, of course. So, fingers crossed when you use this card. Then we got nest balls a night stretcher to retrieve whether it's an energy or an ogie dogie we got switch card in case we can't find the rescue board right here for the tatsugiri typically it's used for tatsugiri but yeah in case you can't find the rescue board this is the thing for you or ursaluna right here gets gusted up then we got artisan to help chain the ogie dogie so ogie dogie in the front ogie dogie in the back things like that then we got Town Store to gain our tools. Our tools, before we get to the supporters, include Bravery Charm to get Ogie Dogie up to 280 if you activate the Adrena Power ability. Then we got, as I said earlier, the EXP share. So if your Ogie Dogie, for example, had like two fighting energy in the active and it got knocked out, and if you had two Ogie Dogie, you could split it evenly. I find that to be cool. I don't know about you. Well, hopefully you find it cool. Then we got the rescue board, as I said, that's for the Tatsugiri mainly, so you can attract customers and retreat to the Ogie Dogie. But uh, supporters of choice include the Arvin. We got boss's orders right here. We got Iono to help hand disrupt in case you're behind. Then we got Penny to, I don't to like help, meaning like trying to. Uh, pick up a damage Ogie Dogie so you don't like get knocked out or like if you're like Ursuluna right here is counter captured and it's not ready to attack yet then that's what Penny's for. Then we got our energies on the bottom here. We got our basic fighting energy along with dark energy for Ogie Dogie in case the luminous energy right here is in case you can't find the luminous energy or uh, you, uh, yeah, in case you can't find the luminous energy or a lot of them are prized. So that's why the dark energy is there to help activate Okie Dokie's ability. Then our A spec of choice is the legacy energy. So the legacy energy can be any type of energy that you want. And it also, like if you're 
in the active spot. So let's just say if a Lugia knocked out Ogie Dogie and it had Legacy Energy in the front, it's a pretty simple way to not get rid of a prize right away. But yeah, a thing I forgot to say is Artisan and the Town Store are very important because a lot of decks play Temple of Sinnoh. I play Temple of Sinnoh a lot because of Lugia. So yeah, try to uh, not use your stadiums haste, like pretty hasty in this deck, if that makes sense. But yeah, uh, hopefully that was a good summary. I appreciate anyone that takes the time to watch my videos and listen to my explanations. So with all that said, let's get to the matches and let's go. Ooh. Okay, good, good, good. That's good. I like that. We will make Ogie Dogie more powerful at the beginning and then hold. I don't know what they're gonna do. I know they are essentially going to peak acceleration me, so I guess they should have went second, but it is what it is. All right. We'll, we'll be fine. It'll be okay. We can bravery charm. Ninja? I need a better hand than this, man. Ooh. Iono. Okay, we could live with Iono. That is fun. Avatar Clash does not like that. No. Mm. Okay. How are we going to do this? This is a bit tricky. Heavy Ball. We'll go for the nest. We can't go for Oogie Doogie, another one actually. Heavy Bowl, what are my prizes? I don't know this deck. Okay, so that's interesting. And a little bit concerning. So conceal cards, we're not gonna get this yet. Not yet anyway. Really? They could destroy it. Okay. I legit have no idea. I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna let them knock me out. Let's see how they're gonna do it. I highly doubt they play any sort of uh, lost vacuum. I don't think Future Box does. All I expect is for them to knock out my Greninja. Hmm. Okay, good. Oh, this is just like iron hands combo. Okay. Go away. That makes sense. That makes total sense. And go for the KO, I assume. Go for it. Just amp me. That would be nice. And my suffering. Thank you. Go for this. Bada bing, bada boom. We will not. Uh. We can't. Get another Oogie Doogie set up. But I'm gonna... I'm gonna good punch first. Before making any decisions. Because it's not like they could just twin shoulder me. And... Yeah, it's not like they could do much. Okay, my EXP was gone anyway. So good thing I didn't bench town store, that would have helped them. 
Presendipity. Okay. I wish there was a way to get a boss besides the one I don't want to put down. We flip the scripts. I really want to get that, Fez. Arvin? Hmm. Techno radar. But the good thing is, but the, I'm apprehensive because I don't know if this deck plays any sort of Temple of Sinnoh. That's the concerning part. And then once this becomes enough, I can hit whatever. Bro. Why? Electric generator, that's okay. Heavy baton, bro. Peak. Okay. Are we going to get a boss? I want a boss so bad. Man, I want a boss. Give me a boss. And no, oh, no boss. This totally sucks. Um. Town store. Let's see. Let's see what's in my deck. I don't know what's in my deck. Well, I guess Tatsugiri is the key. So Arvin. Hmm. Bravery Charm and we'll get a nest. Get that. I put Tatsugiri, right? I can't remember. Yeah, I have Tatsugiri. Makes total sense. Get here. How much is this? 120. No, how much did it do to Greninja? I can't remember, man. Two eighty. Okay. So it's not a total thing, not yet. Well, how do I word it? Luminous energy. Oh my gosh. Well, they could boss me, actually. Mm, Arvin. Lost vacuum. No. Well, actually... No, that's bad. I... Oh, no. I'm so... Can they hit? Like, can they potentially set up another Iron Hands? Oh, wait. They can. But the ta Tatsugiri. Oh, no. Okay, that made me sad. I was like, there's no way they hit, right? And then I realized the the iron iron crowns. This is your girl being an idiot. Can you amp me now? That would be nice. Amp! Thank you. Just 
get my get it over with one and then another one get my other one to here And then I will get my best to get a disruption card because I need it. Attract customers, please give me disruption. I need a disruption. I need a disruption card, please. Oh, dang it. Rip. there here I don't like this artisan well we can use okie dogie as well and good punch punch they'll try to just do the shuttles the iron crowns unless the cruel arrow well hold on what does the heavy baton exactly do i should have read the card before attacking the thing not that i could find a lost vacuum but still but will we win Let's see. One for one energy we hit this. Uh, unless they can somehow get another iron hands, I don't see us losing. But it could happen. I will be completely shocked, but I will not be completely surprised either. So yeah, Fletcher Jin, please be lucky. Oh my, she's. Wow. What, what? Another Iron Crown. And I hit anything with the Luna. I hit anything with the bear. Uh, that only does, only hits for extra. But if I had the legacy energy, that would have been good by now. Like, ah, this is not good. But at the same time, I'm not concerned because this, they can't do the sparking strike attack. And I have boss, so I could hit whatever I want. Iodo. I just had to say it. And I get my other boss anyway. Okay. That's fun. Now, if I can get to my turn, that would be so appreciative. Wait a minute, do I hit? Yeah, I hit even with the... without bossing. But we're still fun in that! We boss up the iron hands, of course. Right? And as you can see, they're avoiding the situation and not realizing that I could literally just hit hit it for X amount of damage, so we'll legacy, and there you go. Um, I had boss in hand, but either way, I would've won, so there it is. Um, maybe I should've won second. I mean, I should've gone first. Ugh, I cannot believe I willingly went first, but at the same time, I didn't know I was going to go against Festival Lead, so... That's my defense. That's my argument. And now I know what's in their hand. 
we will figure it out together. So, I think town store, we will keep town store for the sake of Because I want to bump off their festival lead thing. We'll do that. I will... Don't know. Okay, that's a... We'll put one fighting here. We're going to attract customers. Can we get an orbit, please? Research... Is that what I want, though? I know they have the- I know they have whatever they need in there, so we're not gonna... Deal with that right now. Ooh! Oh, oh, oh. Get that there. Put that there. Oh, wow. It was a... Energy sticker. This is probably supposed to be late game, but. Hello, Santa. Switch. Hits. Good punch. I know they probably will get the Diplin combo somehow, but. This is my best bet. This is all I got. Research. I should have gotten Greninja. Again, the... I was too fast in the gameplay. Uh... Applins and Grookey. Arvin. Oh! Okay, they got a Diplin. Is this... Purely festival? Um... That's not hot, man. We gotta research. I guess it's good that I I own owed. But I probably realize too that they're more focused on setting up, so Oh wow, you're not even focusing on the Krookie? Energy Lotto Luminous I'm going to do a nest ball. Go for... I want to go for ninja. Arvin. We'll do with that and a I don't know. What's in my this nothing's in my car <sighs> the earth the vessel is gone. Well actually I think the night stretcher could help me. one here we'll put one here and good punch once more and then we will get the okie dogie boss that's good
And then we could ogie dogie. Oh. What is in this this card? We used like okay, two bug catching set, one Evo. Defiance. Well kinda of doomed. Hmm. Okay, this is not good. Do the wave. Oh, right! Artisan, we could get the Grookey! Sleep boss. Get Grookey. Hi, bud. Then we good punch. One here. I know we're keeping Defiance best. Or not best. Defiance banned. Uh, dip one active, but. I'll take it. We will be fine. And I'm kind of glad that this happened. Now what are we going to do? Bug catching set. Is this going to be like a hydrapple situation? Nope. I guess not. Appwin, Artisan, the question is, do they have the festival lead? Let's hope that they don't. Ugh. Ayodo, no, I had the perfect hand, perfect combo! Oh, okay. Put that there. It sounds perfect, actually. We'll get the Tatsugiri. We'll get the attract customers. Penny is not that great. But we will do this. Nest bowl. I'll add. I'll add a iron. No. I'll have to add another ogie dogie in things in case things go sour. Put that there. Let's go here. And good punch. Two more hits on whatever. Now, if it's possible to penny a uh, ogie dogie, that would be spectacular. I've got a penny up an ogie dogie. Because I'm not sure, to be honest, if there's going to be a Defiance Band. If there is, oh well. But we tried, so. Art is on. No festival ground. Well, we got the one with the Defiance Band. Band. I'm not sure. Yeah, Festival Grounds. Okay, finally. We got somewhere. Boom Boom Groove. Pretty sure it's a Defiance, a defiance Band. 
like that extra that bit of an extra oomph to the Pokemon on his aid it's fine getting another Applin so we're gonna penny if we survive this I don't think I'm gonna survive this it will be a miracle if I do roll up boom what in the world is that attacks and its retreat cost is one more interesting all right I guess it's time to realize that Penny is helpful annoying never mind I can't penny so yeah I was gonna penny attach a fighting to the one with the luminous and then it, exp shared to another okie dokie that was gonna be the plan and then wait it out and then I'm assuming they would have not iota me and if they did it I would have just hit the boss like that's all I was gonna do Alright everyone, thank you so much for your time. Hopefully you enjoyed those matches. Please like and subscribe to the channel for more fun and I'll see you soon. Thank you.